Hey everybody, this is U-Boat the Silent Wolf. Now this is a game that we've been waiting to play for quite some time now. And uh, as you can see, we're here on the Quest 3 and it looks absolutely amazing. So, as you know, this is kind of a game that is based off of some German history here and uh, really don't know much else about it other than we are going to be captaining a U-boat uh, and I know there is four player co-op on this as well which is really really cool too so uh, we'll take a look at our settings we definitely have quite a few here uh, we have our locomotion, uh, we can adjust our height and things like that, which is cool. Very simple there, the rotation. Of course, we got smooth and instant, so it's got all the basics covered. Uh, we also have our languages here, which is absolutely perfect. Uh, we have subtitles on and off, uh, standing and seated, and left-handed and right-handed. Uh, you can pick up little objects here, and they just look so freaking cool to me, man. It's It looks great for a standalone game. There's no doubt about it. So, uh, let's go ahead. It looks like there's a free play mode, but we are going to start a new game here uh, just so we can see what it's all about. You boat the silent wolf. It's just a, such a cool title for a game, man. Never interrupt your enemy when he is making a mistake. Napoleon. Okay. Quite interesting. Pretty cool quote there. Oh. Go ahead and walk up. Looks like we're in a courtroom. Oh, no. What do we do? What did we do? I think I might need this cigarette. I hereby open hearing number BV-13D in the case of the captain of the German U-boat. Sir, <sighs> you are known for your courage and loyalty to the Reich. Okay. Your accomplishments on the world seas were appreciated by Kriegsmarine commanders. You have fulfilled every order with precision and devotion. But that same dogmatism for the German Reich's ideas has brought you to this court. Oh man, here we go. Sir. We must Please have been real bad. Detail how your duty well, I like the watch. Began. And what was your relation to the captain? Uh-oh. So is it gonna is it gonna show our story? Well, I guess we're gonna play the story, which puts us into the courtroom, I guess. Baptism by fire. Clear the port entrance. Okay, so we're in the 1940s here, so we got an exact date. That's great. Oh boy, look at that. Hey, you, cadet. It's your first Ahoy there, matey. after the academy, isn't it? Yes, I would be. Good. Well, I probably shouldn't stand in front of that. Yes, as you Let's can tell, you I'm fresh real. from the academy. You will be our helmsman today. Okay. As you see, it's a brand new U-boat Type 7C. It has some improvements. Let's see how it runs. Come on, go up the ladder. All right, let's go ahead. We have ahead. a lot of work to do. Go up the ladder, huh? Well, look at them, they're just chilling. Let mechanics start oh. the diesel engines. Use engine order telegraph. Full ahead. Okay. Full ahead. The course is 10 degrees port. That vessel on the horizon. Ah, over there. That one Grab all the, the way over there. Wheel. Get us out Grab of the harbor. Grab the steering wheel. Ooh, you got a scar. You must, you, you're, you're a ruffian. I know it. We got the music volume here. We'll turn that down a little wheel. bit in case we need to talk. Okay. Go ahead and start steering towards that, I guess. Simple and easy. Oh, look at that. You can look over it and, and see. And don't get me wrong. I don't know what's port. I don't know what's starboard. I don't know none of that. So, uh, I'd make There's a terrible sailor. In waiting. Just use your watch. Oh, so we can fast forward. Our order Fifteen is to times, huh? Oh, okay, so as soon as we grab the wheel, the it stops. Onward with speed. This is where we crank up the music, right? Okay, reach the red zone. Oh, as soon as I touch the music, it stops. 
Hang on, bud. We're definitely going fast. We can see everything flying past us. That's cool that speeds up, because uh, we'd be here all day otherwise. Okay. We need to sink that rubbish. It's blocking our warships. Okay. Shoot it a few times with the deck cannon. We don't want to waste a precious torpedo on that. The deck cannon, huh? Okay. All right, here we go. Let's go to the deck cannon and destroy. Go hey, on. Hey, hey. We must send that ship to the seabed. Do the honors. Oh. Use Almost sank to us. Adjust the distance and pull lever to shoot. I was almost dead on there. Did I get it? I think I might have hit it. No? Maybe we'll lower it just a little bit. Let's see. Our accuracy is not so good. I can't even see that far. I need my... I need glasses on top of glasses. I feel like maybe I'm shooting over it. There we go. That sucker hit it. There we go. Now it's sinking. Sorry about that, Captain, wherever you are. Silence on board. Can you hear it? It doesn't sound like our Messerschmitts. Uh-oh. Enemy planes. Watch out. Destroy Enemy them planes. with this machine gun or take cover. Oh, there they are. There they are over there. Oh, my gosh. We better get up there. We better get up there. Oh, crap. Look at this. This is nuts. Oh, boy, I didn't even see this one coming so close to me. Oh, those are bombs for sure. I thought I hit this one. Oh, I did hit that one. Boom, that's what's up. Got the 360 view here. Kind of hitches up a little bit, it looks like. Might need to be optimized a little bit. I get one. Got one. Got two. Okay, all right. So far, so good, I think. Maybe we should be standing up for this. Looks like maybe we should, but... I don't know. Get back in my circle. I don't see any more. Oh, there they are. Got one. There we go. Take that. Whoever you are. I don't see any more. They must hey. have seen our shots and got okay, cool. out of the port town got and the it. aircraft defenses. Well, that was kind of neat. Wow, and you are not full of bullet holes. That I am alone not. is a great job. I like you. <laughs> Seems I like, like you too. Safe now. I just want to speak with, in English as a, with a German accent so bad, but it, it would probably right be terrible. Support. We have a few days until the next task. Okay. Going back to port then. We will, we will see you in the port. Okay, what the heck? Use the gangway. Alright. So it looks like you're really not interacting with everything. You're kind of ah, just yes. Come in. touching some things. I hope you slept well after our party yesterday. Kind of need to, to adjust celebrate. my but height. Don't get I wonder. Used to it. You will wonder probably never see home again. I got some as many of good here men you seen in last game night. to do that. I need your stamp I don't think we do. Here. I know you can I like adjust you your height. I, I just. During the next mission, I'll show you all of the core systems the of the U-boat, so you can take over in case of failure. Okay. 
Let's see. Our new U-boat needs to be tested for depth diving capabilities. Reach 160 meters of depth to confirm safety. Bureaucracy will kill us yeah, faster sure. than the Alliance. Why not? We sail out in a day. There you go. After There's that for you. And last checks, it will take us a Just day to reach the air, but, you know. from the order and proceed to test dive the first patrol if we don't die before that. Yeah, definitely make sure you calibrate your height because it definitely uh, totally needs that. I'm feeling a little off for sure. First dive. Okay. All right, Sir, let's good. try Perfect it. Perfect timing. We're gonna Come go on, down officer. below. Get down to the control room and proceed with dive sequence steps. I'm after you. Oh, he is so. Watch your steps. Whoa! All wet. My bad. With your hands so you can get down safe. Oh, okay. Captain is already waiting for you down below. Thank you, sir. Reporting all day, sunny, sir. It's time to flood the main. Well, this is crazy looking. Prepare to dive. Prepare, dive, dive, Ready dive. dive. Oh. We haven't said that yet. Well, there's just like you strong meat hanging guy. back here. Open what is the this? Ballast tanks to fill them with water. Better use both hands. It looks heavy in this model. Okay. Oof. So I gotta. Take it fully open. It's flooding slower than in previous models, but instructions say it's gonna close itself under the pressure. Open. German engineering at its best. Okay. I think it. I think I did it right. Did I do it right? Hell's Open. Depth. depth meter. Oh man, so I have no idea what I'm doing. No idea what I'm doing. Oh, neutral, neutral. Oh God, what I do? Oh man, I have no clue what I'm doing here. Help! Help me, Tom Cruise. Yeah. Yeah. Boy, you can feel the physics on that for sure. Can I can I get some better instructions, please? Something Down periscope. Dive sequence. Investigate it. We need to reach neutral buoyancy before we dive deeper. Neutral buoyancy. Okay. Let's see. Depth meter. Neutral buoyancy. Bow planes, rudder control. All right, so let's let's open you back up here, I guess. Nothing interrupted the dive sequence. Investigate it. We need to reach neutral buoyancy before we dive deeper. Thanks for the info, but uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. No idea what I'm doing. Open. It's flooding slower than in previous models, but instructions say it's gonna close itself under the pressure. German engineering at its best. Okay. So good. My last tank's full of water. We've settled on periscope depth. Now let's see if we can withstand the pressure. <laughs> sure. Officer, take control over the depth steerings. Depth Use just steerings. the left plane wheel to start changing our depth. Right one will make us tilt a little more and dive a little faster. Okay. Can you see the depth meter? We're slowly yes. going down. Good. Let us sink to 160. Speed up the time with your watch. Let's do it. I can tell you, I was lost as heck there, just pulling levers, which is probably not good. But I had no idea what I was doing. At all. No real, like, I don't know. It's kind of odd. We only go five times, huh? So we're gonna we're gonna meters. wait this one out. Look at you, just standing all nice and calm, not let's caring. Let's push the limits, but let's not push our luck today. Push let's it to aim the to limits. Let's 160 meters and hold off on testing the maximum depth of 230 oh, meters. Test okay. diving. You yeah, have no clue what. I was doing whatsoever there. I would love to see some instructions, especially like, I, I don't know, maybe just at the very beginning. That'd be pretty
pretty cool. I guess this kind of is a tutorial level, but there's so many gadgets everywhere. They just like throw you right in, it seems like. Now, I think this is where like the co-op comes in. You all have a position here in the room and got to got to get to it, which I'm sure is probably crazy. You all have to work together as a team real good, I'm sure of that. 100 meters. Okay, let's go. We're going at five times speed, and it's already super slow still. But I get it, you're in a submarine. I know nothing about submarines, but I would figure you need to go to the depths really, really slow. pressurize the cabin and all that other good stuff which I'm sure we'll learn in this game at some point what happens if I just uh, switch this or that oh, 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 oh no I didn't want to do that there we go close it it all stops that's <laughs> okay what if I do this or this oh yeah it all stops uh, it wants me to finish this, clearly. Not past 2.30, I think they said? Tick-tock, 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 tick-tock. Well, it's 10.30 in the morning. Yeah, it's a little annoying how much you have to wait, but I get it. All right, we reached the testing depth. Oh my gosh, what is that? Fix, Fix the, the leak. leak. With this, the hammer. Go, pow, pow, pow. pow. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's just assume we're safe up to 160 meters. God, could you imagine? Use pump to get rid of the water. Which pump? Okay, this pump. Can you imagine being in a real submarine and that happening? I would lose my mind. Okay. I don't... Do I just keep pumping it? Let's go back to the surface. Blow okay. Blow compressed air to the ballast tanks, cadet. Valve is over there. Open. Good. Now the ship is surfacing. Okay. So that's how we let it all the out. Is low. We feel needed. Okay. You gonna show me how to do that, buddy old pal? Air levels are low, that can't be good. Are we just gonna wing it here and see what happens? Running out of air, I just, I don't know, that sounded terrible to me. But, I guess we can just, uh, you know, roll these dice and see what happens. Oh, okay. Are we gonna make it, or not? I don't know. Okay. Oh, new okay. torpedoes. Orders are orders. Let's see the new coordinates. Pull down the map. Pull Switch down the map. Ah, okay. Got a nice map there. Okay, pretty pretty interactive. Looks really cool. We've received the order to track down and sink the British battleship in this area. Oh. Mark the route with these pins. Attach one to the objective mark. How do I know what the objective mark is? Is it this one? I guess. I hope you pick the right location. Yeah, Pull me too. Lever. You will feel like time passed faster. Uh oh. Uh. I can't grab 
Ziliva. What the heck is going on here? Did I, did I mark the right spot? You I would, we need I would to figure so. Oh, okay, there we go. The map has to be down. I hope that's it. Good. Go up to the Conning Tower. From there, we can target the enemies and launch torpedoes. Okay. Okay, officer. I'll need you to lock onto the enemy using the attack periscope. Can you see the ship? Uh. Oh wow. You can that, use that is really cool. The light controller to look around. Zoom and periscope height and viewfinder are all adjustable. Can you see the tanker? Okay, the there's the zoom. By pressing the button. Oh, that's the, the height. Remember to make the calculations three times. Otherwise, we may miss. Oh, gosh. This is not easy. Not easy at all. Where'd I just see him? I just saw him somewhere. Press the button to see the target and get their speed and distance. Calculated? Okay. We're running low on compressed air. Okay. Now what? I clearly have shown where they're at. Run the measuring sequence by pressing the button. Well, this is not easy at all. Gotta get right in the center here. Our compressed air reserves are almost. Oh, jeez. Can you imagine doing this back in the day? This is absolutely insane. Okay, I think we did it. I think Run we did it, bro. Sequence by pressing the button. Pressuring sequence. I thought I did that. Which pressuring? Can we hit them all? Hit them all. We're running low on compressed air. Calculations. Yeah, let's just launch it. Why not? I'm pointed right at it. Do we hit it? Okay, signal is back. You can see current estimated distance and enemy speed on the torpedo data calculator to the right. Holy cow. Check it a few times. Need to be to a be mathematician to do this. Oh, I see. So you got to actually. Alright, so we're at 19. Select torpedo tubes from the panel below. Ugh. Torpedo ready. Okay. Torpedo ready. Let's go. Select torpedo tubes. If calculations are correct and the periscope is aimed, you can use that lever to launch the torpedoes. Uh, I think so. Let's, uh, we got a speed? No. Uh, let's, let, yeah, let's go for it. Let's just see what happens. Torpedo ready. How do we, how do, can we see in there and see if it blows up? Did we launch it or no? Did we screw up? I think we might have screwed up. Torpedo hit the target. Oh, okay. It did hit it. Cool. I'm reporting the we missed it, sunk. but it did Order hit it. A fulfilled. Just take forever. So Boy, this game is hard. I could the play it this with your friends would be really, there. really hard. Go back to any port using a map. So okay. Which port? Well, let's let's just go to uh, this one. Why not? Let's try this one. Let's go. Kiel. A few hours later. Now I wonder how long the story is. This is that was some in-depth stuff, and I'm sure the missions get pretty wild. That's for sure. I like the story so far, though, and, like, the animations and all that. Looks Hello? cool. Scheiße, we've got a compressed air leak somewhere. Scheiße! Go! 
uh, compressed air leak, huh? Okay, how do we do that? Find air leak and fix it. Sounds like it's over here. Yep, yep, there we go. There we go. Let us fill the gaps and sail quickly back to the port. Got a typewriter here. This is probably our, uh... And turn it on before we move on. Our Morse code, or whatever you want to call it, out. Alright, go to the compressor in the rear torpedo room. Let's do it. Okay, here we are. What do we need to do? Oh, we got the bathroom. There we go. I mean, the sub looks really, really cool as far as all that goes. It looks very neat. Okay, so it's back here, the other way. Okay, opening up our hatches. Pretty neat. <laughs> Bananas. Hey, man, what's up? So you will also swab the deck and cook our food. Watch your head. Both compressors should work. Electric and diesel. Okay. Uh, how do we start this bad boy? Just push that button? Okay. Man, this is insane. You and your friends would have to communicate so much in order to... Whoa! Watch it, bud! Jeez Louise! Got beams coming out of nowhere. I don't know my way around here. I'm a newbie. Okay. We should sink it according to What's orders, in here? Sir. Another bathroom. Torpedoes. Someone run to the torpedo depot to help load them up. Help load them up. All the way down here, huh? I can only. Oh man, it it, it does a pretty good job of how you would really be living on a uh, a submarine. That's for sure. Not a life I would want to live at all. Help reload torpedoes. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, wait a moment. Let me first show you how to load these torpedoes. Yeah, Focus, you probably should. You have to repeat the whole sequence after me. First, you must pump out the water from the hatch. Otherwise, it will spill out. Okay. Then we unbolt the hatch. And then open it. After that, use the chains to pull out the torpedo. Alright. Gosh. Being on like a... Oh, man. That would scare me so much. Finally, what if they, the you, you just hit it wrong and it exploded? It and lock it. Now, use the lever on the side to flood the tube with water. Okay. The torpedo is ready to fire. Now it's your turn. If you follow Let's my instructions, see. Hold on. everything will work just fine. Alright, so... Unflood it. Unlock it. Raise it. Oh, we gotta go. Raise it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. We keep doing it? Yep, there we go. Oh, jeez. Close it. Ugh. Close it. Lock it. Flood it. Whew. Okay. So, we're gonna unflood it. Open it. Boy, that's a little, that's a little difficult for sure. Jeez Louise. Ugh. Let's see. Pretty cool though, the mechanics and everything work very, very well for what you're trying to do. It just, uh, it feels, oh, it, it makes it feel like you're in a tight space, which you actually would be in a real submarine. 
Okay. Let's see. Some serious work, for sure. Yeah, he's just gonna stand there, watch me do it all. I appreciate that, bud. Appreciate that. Close her up, lock it down, fill it up. Hard work for sure. Okay, to shoot down the enemy. Very, very interesting. Like I said, this is really, really cool. It, it, it totally lets you see what it was like to be on a submarine back in the day. No doubt about it. I love the design of the submarine. Uh, here's the Morse code right here. I knew there was Morse code somewhere, but I, I it just it feels really cool how you're able to kind of put yourself uh, in the day in the life of someone who would be on here, and it's definitely not an easy job and not a fun one either. It, it's not hard to see how miserable these guys are or were. And, uh, but somebody had to do the job, for sure. There's no doubt we about it. The captain's room, huh? I guess, would that be the captain? Are you the captain? I don't know who's the captain. Pretty neat little game. Okay, up here, there it is. We up again, yep. Okay, I guess we're gonna go back we we landed at nighttime here so but yeah pretty pretty cool and interesting i love the graphics you know they're they're definitely not anything special uh but it gets the the point across of what's going on here for sure and uh i love how there's I missions in between news for everything you, cadet. your course is almost over is it now hereby my work here is nearly done Headquarters will be sending me to another U-boat soon. Okay. This order will prove if you're actually ready to take the helm. Okay, so let's take a look at these orders here. It says, Reconnaissance aircraft have been reported a lone craft. HMS Black Swan between the Faroe Islands and Iceland. If we get there quickly, we can destroy it. The weather forecast promise very thick fog. And uh, I think I'm just going to leave it right there for you. Um, like I said before, very, very interesting game. I love the submarine. I love how it puts you in a day in the life of, uh, you know, basically in the Navy, I guess you could say, uh, being on a submarine. And I know it's a job I did not want to do. I definitely uh, have a friend whose dad was in a submarine, like, all the time. And uh, just some of the stories he tells us are, is really, really cool. But imagine being down there and confined all the time, just... Not something I'd want to deal with, but very cool little game here. I like how there's all kinds of different missions you're probably about to go on and how you have to really do all the the things in the submarine uh, in order to, to survive. And I would love to see how this game plays in co-op. Uh, eventually, I may actually play it. Uh, I'm not 100% sure, though. Um, I like what's going on, but I'm not sure it's got my attention uh, to keep playing it, believe it or not. So I might play a little bit more and see how the, uh, the co-op is. Uh, I feel like playing co-op, you will definitely need your friends to be pretty uh, good and savvy at communication because... Uh, it definitely looks hard already. So with that being said, uh, this is one I'd probably pick up on sale if you can. Uh, there's a few bugs here and there, uh, especially when you're walking around and even in the in the cabin here. It uh, looked like things were floating and, and just some hiccups here and there that I wish we could, we could fix. I'd like to climb the ladder out on the U-boat itself. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, it'd make it a little bit more immersive for sure. Uh, other than that, not too bad at all. Make sure you check out your height settings uh, before you dive in. And uh, if you like what you saw, make sure you check out all the links in the description below. Might be a little discount down there. Just make sure you check it out. 
And if you like the channel and you like what I'm doing, make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell, and we'll see you on the next episode.